How is it going Samsung users Mr Android here welcome back to a brand new video on this channel well finally i got the one ui 4 beta 3 on my galaxy s21 plus the update size is around 950 mb and samsung has added some amazing new features with this big update with that being said in this video i will be showing you all the new features that has been added with one ui 4 beta 3 so make sure you guys watch this video till the very end also let's aim for 1500 likes on this one so drop a like leave a comment and let's get started Alright guys, I have finally installed One UI 4 Beta 3 on my Galaxy S21 Plus and the first thing that I have noticed is the over scrolling effect that I get while scrolling any pages on my phone. If I scroll up and down, you can see this beautiful effect which looks quite nice. It is already present in Google Pixel devices but I am glad Samsung has added this effect in One UI 4 as well. Next if I go to settings, then to display and go inside this option called as full screen apps. Here you can easily select all the applications for which you want to hide the camera cutout. For example, if I want to hide the notch, whenever I use YouTube application, all I have to do is select YouTube and then select this option called hide camera cutout. Now whenever I open YouTube, my notch will get disappear. You can do this for any app that you have installed on your phone. Again a very handy feature that Samsung has added with Beta 3. Now let's talk about these beautiful icons. If I go to settings. Wallpaper and Style, go inside Color Palette, below you get this brand new option called Apply Palette to App Icons. Once I select this option, what it does is, it changes the color of your app icons depending on the wallpaper that you have applied. So if you really want to customize your Samsung phone, all you need to do is change the wallpaper. It will automatically change the accent color and even customize your app icons as well. Currently it only works for system applications. So if I open my app drawer, you can see all the third party applications that I have downloaded from the play store looks different. The next big change is in the weather application. If I tap on this weather widget, you can see it has this beautiful animation that looks absolutely stunning. The weather app has been totally redesigned and if we compare this with One UI 3.1, I think it looks very pleasant to your eyes. I just love the new animations that we get in One UI 4.0. Finally, if I talk about the overall experience, I think after the beta 3 update, all the animations are much better and smooth and there is no lag while opening or closing applications. They have tried to fix a lot of bugs in this update and also they have added some cool features which is a great thing. I think Samsung is doing a great job with Android 12 and I really can't wait to see what they are going to offer with beta 4. So that's pretty much it guys, this was a quick video showing you all the new features in beta 3. If you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.